common form of arthritis that affects 1 in 40 adults in the UK. It's caused by high levels of uric acid, a chemical produced by the breakdown of tissues in the body and present in certain foods and drinks. At high levels, uric acid is deposited and around joints as needle-shaped urate crystals. Once released from their deposits, these crystals cause severe inflammation manifesting as joint pain, swelling, redness and tenderness that often last for one to two weeks. Hello and welcome to Medical Dialogues, your daily dose of health and medical news. I'm Mr. Zaman and today I'm going to talk about the link between heart attacks, stroke and gout flare-ups. Experts at the University of Nottingham in collaboration with experts at Keele University have found the risk of heart attacks and strokes temporarily increases in the four months after a gout flare. The results of the study, led by Professor Abhishek in the School of Medicine at the University of Nottingham, are published in the journal JAMA. The team used anonymized data from 62,574 patients with gout treated in the National Health Services in the UK. Of these, 10,475 experienced heart attack or stroke after the diagnosis of gout, while others of similar age, sex and duration of gout did not experience such events. They evaluated the association between heart attacks or strokes and recent gout flares and adjusted these results for comorbidities, socioeconomic deprivation, lifestyle factors and prescribed medications among other things. They found that gout patients who suffered a heart attack or stroke were twice as likely to have a gout flare in the 60 days prior to the event and one and a half times more likely to have a gout flare in the preceding 61 to 120 days. They found a similar high rate of heart attack or stroke in the 0 to 60 and 61 to 120 days after gout flares compared with other time periods when they used information from only patients who consulted for a gout flare and also experienced either heart attack or stroke. This further strengthened the finding that gout flares are associated with a transient increase in cardiovascular events following flares. Gout patients who died from a heart attack or stroke had over four times the odds of experiencing a gout flare in the preceding 0 to 60 days and over twice the odds of gout flare in the preceding 61 to 120 days. People with gout should be encouraged to adopt a healthy lifestyle with appropriate treatment of conditions such as high blood pressure, high cholesterol, obesity and diabetes to minimize their background risk of heart attack and stroke, the authors noted. That's all for today. Stay tuned to Medical Dialogues for latest updates. Never miss a medical update from Medical Dialogues. Like, subscribe and press the bell icon.